What's going on everybody? Medina here doing a special video for you guys today. This time I am going through the ladder playing Smoke and I'm going to show you guys how to do the ability for Smoke, Shang, I mean, ah, Sing Sung, he, you can already do that, for, <laughs> for Kentaro and Goro. And what you see with it, what you see I just did is I changed my controller preset to 2 because the whole um, way you do this is you go up the ladder, you perform either any kind of ality to every character before uh, Shang Tsung, so I just did Babality. So I, 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 no, actually I think I think I did a Fatality. You do, I did a Fatality for every character, and when you go against Shang Tsung, you need to do a Babality. And for Smoke, his Babality is down, back, down, forward, down, from jump distance away. So it's it's a little tricky to figure out. I never really know where the hell jump distance is, but once you get it down, you'll be doing it no problem. And then when you go against Shang Tsung, you need to make sure that you go against Shang Tsung's human form. And you uh, do the ability to Shang Tsung while he's human. And if you do it right, you should be you should next go to Kentaro or Goro. And when you face them, you can't block. So you need to beat them without blocking. And also keep in mind, in doing this whole challenge, you have to move up the ladder without losing a single match. And it has to be on the difficulty of medium or higher. So it's actually a pretty difficult challenge to do, and the only thing you get out of it is to watch their abilities, which it is pretty funny to watch. And plus, I just like kicking their ass. That's always that's always nice to do. Usually, nothing happens for Goro or Kentaro, but when you do it this way, and here's uh, Kentaro. Aw. Smoke wins. Big ability. <laughs> and I think that's pretty hilarious. That's Kentaro's ability. And next, I'm going to show you Goro's. And by the way, I just uploaded... Look, I have zero rounds lost, zero matches lost, and there's only like nine minutes into the match. Um, my In my other video, like I was getting a lot of trolls seeing that I had 23 matches lost when I was playing as Liu Kang. All those matches that I lost... Well, it said 51 rounds. Well, no crap, there's two rounds in a match. So if you lose 23 times, that means you're going to end up losing 46 rounds total, you know, so... That's a given. That's that's not a surprising number, but Liu Kang is not good for Goro or Shao Kahn. So like, I had no problem whatsoever taking out the normal people. But when you go against these cheap bastards, you need somebody else. You know, you really do. Liu Kang is not a good character to use against them, and that's why I struggled so much. At the same time, I was on hard difficulty, so the the amount that they spam and do cheap things is even you know just increased by tenfold. But it, it doesn't mean I'm a bad player. People are all like, "Dude, you suck. You should like play beginner instead." And I just get innately raped right here by freaking Goro's goddamn X-ray attack. And it's cheap stuff like this. This thing does 52% damage. You know that's insane. It, it, it it's like I'm not a bad player because I lost a lot of times to Goro and Shao Kahn. Like if you're if you're gonna call me a bad player, at least play against me first, and then say I'm a bad player. Like it, it's just ridiculous. But trolls will be trolls, so I don't even know why I'm fighting it. And um, spoiler alert: I do go on a flawless this round. So you want you guys want to find out what happens when you flawless girl? You guys will see. And smoke? Yes, I just started using smoke yesterday. Actually, I just started. I started playing the ladder with him on Expert, just getting a uh, feeling for him and stuff like that. And he's actually pretty sweet. I really like him. He doesn't have a projectile that does damage. You get, oh yeah, you get absolutely nothing. Nothing for doing a flawless against Goro, which is kind of gay. You would think it, you at least get like 10,000 coins or something. But no, no, you, you just get the normal 1,000. Smoke. No projectile that he actually hits people with except that smoke ball that you just saw right there. And I use that smoke wall a lot. You, you'll see that it's part of my combos. I actually found a 15, a 15 hit, 52% combo with smoke, and it's pretty damn sweet. I do gotta say, it, his timing for his juggles are a little bit tricky, but once you get them down, you're gonna be raping with them. Like, like I said, I want I, or like you see, you should be seeing this. I go through this whole ladder without losing a single match, and. I do it really quickly. I th you, you'll see the, the stats at the end of this. But this is Goro's. Smoke wins. Big ballot. And for Shao Kahn, it was supposed to be the same exact thing. Well, actually, not really. For Shao Kahn, you're just supposed to beat him, and that's it, and it does it. So that's what I was like, okay, yeah, you know, I'm gonna do it to Shao Kahn. Let's see what happens. And this is the end of the match. I'm like, holy shit, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. And then I do it, and I wait for the babality. 
and nothing happens. Nothing. So, screw that. I don't know what I did wrong. I'm not going to try to figure it out. But I just went through the ladder again, just to prove that I can go through the whole ladder without losing a single match or a round. And then, you guys will see what I'm doing. Oh, I'm changing my controller preset right now to 1, because it was on 2. And I change it that way so I don't accidentally hit black when I go against uh, Kentaro or Goro. Because I was doing that a lot. And when you have to, when you do the ability against them, you, you have to win that match without blocking. So it makes things a little tricky. And after just getting innerly raped by Shao Kahn for 10 million times, I've actually gotten pretty good at beating him. And usually I'm able to dodge that hammer. I'm able to parry it because Smoke has this one, uh, you guys will see it. Uh, when I get my distance, whenever he throws an arrow or a hammer, I usually do the, the parry that I'm talking about. You guys will see it in a second. But, oh, I actually get hit with it right there. But Shao Kahn is pretty predictable in the things he, do, he does. When you knock him down and you get close to him, usually he does... Here, I do it right here. When you knock him down and you get close to him, he does a wake-up attack, which is a, a hammer throw from underneath. It's a sweep hammer. So you just got to go for a low block. There it is. You, you just got to do a low block to prevent it, and I should have probably done that. Um, and then he also has a hammer from above, which you just gotta do a normal block to do. And when you get your distance from him, he's, he'll start talking crap. So depending on what character, ooh, that was a pretty sweet combo. So depending on what character you have, you can actually just hit him with projectile or teleport close to him. And for me, I throw my smoke, smoke ball, and then I start doing some combos from here, and that's how I mess up Chao Kahn myself. But try not to be too aggressive with him. Just take your time. You, you have plenty of time to beat him. You just gotta be really methodical and careful with everything you do. I tried jumping over the hammer there because you can do it. You can jump over it and then counter him right away. And that's what I tend to do. But I was actually, I don't know, tired at this point. There's a lot of mistakes in this video that I see I'm doing that I usually don't make. Um, yeah, every time he taunts you, you gotta, you gotta make him punish it. <laughs> you have to punish him for it because you don't get them often. And especially when you're playing on Harder Expert, he's not gonna taunt you very often. So whenever it happens, take advantage of it. Pull out your best combo that you know. You know, juggle him, do whatever you can. And Smoke is a great character to use against Shao Kahn. Um, I, well, I don't know what else I have. I'm, I, I th I'm gonna s just upload a video showing some of Smoke's combos that I like to do. And for the most, yeah, he's done. I got an X-ray right here. It, it should do about 18, 19% damage. So he's pretty much over there. And that's about it. Uh, oh, I just unlocked all the secret battles with all the other characters, which is Noob, Smoke, and Reptile. Those secret battles. And I shall be uploading those to, um, to my personal channel, probably today or something. Anyways, this has been Medina, and I'm out. Shao Kahn's violent death shook the very core of Smoke's being oh, yeah, make sure you and check dislodged his Sorry, earliest off. memories. Tomas Rabada was only a boy when he was abducted by an obscure cult and sacrificed to a demon. Burned alive, he returned to the mortal realm as an Anenra, a creature of smoke and vapor. His captors were helpless against his shapeless form as he lashed out with rage, killing them all. His murder revenged, he returned to his human form, remembering nothing of his former life. Now aware of his true identity, Smoke understands he is no mere assassin. His destiny has been revealed. Alright, here are my stats. I did it in 12 minutes on medium. My fastest match was 32 seconds. I received a total of 886 damage, and my longest combo was 13. I can actually do a 15 combo one, but I just probably messed it up while I was playing. Anyways, if you guys want to flame me for that, then go right ahead. I know there's going to be somebody that does it. I'm Medina, and I'm out. Hey, guys. We now have our own website. Actually, we've always had our own website, but why not follow us on there? There you'll find all our videos conveniently sorted into playlists by game, as well as videos from many other directors that are part of our NGT network. And here you can create subscriptions for individual games and only receive notifications for new videos uploaded for the games that you are subscribed to. Isn't that fantastic? No more spam video email notifications. And stay in touch with us on our full featured forums. Remember, all the relevant links are always in the description of our videos. Click on them. Come join us on our website. We'll see you there.